Hello Millennials and Gen Z. Now we are going to cover the most important topic as also suggested in the Ashish Vashwani paper Attention All You Need. So let's get to the journey of multi-head attention. In multi-head attention there is a couple of matrix multiplication. Every token vector moves through the multiple matrix calculation and generated the same dimensional vector like this is the is four dimensional vector again after processing through the block of multi head attention 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 block then again four dimensional vector gets generated with some new numbers over here which represents the change in the number over here represents now the the this the new vector for the represents the numbers which are impacted by all other tokens provided in the context let's look into the calculation with just three words the quick brown limited number of words so that we can see how the calculation goes on between this small set of vector every attention layer contains these weights query weights key weights and value weights where these weights come from these weights are first randomly initialized then during the training it gets learned the number so these are the learned weights which used to calculate the the token query key and value let's calculate the query key value for the input vector so the quick and brown here the now let's calculate the query for the the input query key and value how do we calculate how do we calculate this for query the weights multiplied by matrix multiplied by embedding of the like one two three four here is also one two three four this matrix is over here and now it gets multiplied the resultant is this the like this same key key the way we calculate the key and in the with the same process we calculate the value of the matrix multiplication with the vector finally we get q the k the and v the similarly we calculate q q kv value for the qkv value for quick qkv value for brown as we have calculated qkv for all of all of our token like the quick brown let's calculate the attention score for the so to calculate the attention score for the we need to get the dot product between the query and the key so now the attention score of the gets calculated with the so query of the dot product with key of the so already we have query of the and key of the so their dot product is a scalar quantity and it comes as 7.96 similarly the attention score of the with quick so query of the gets dot product with key of quick it comes out to be 8.32 attention score now we calculate the attention score of the with brown so query of the with key of brown dot product we get 7.05 like this 
like this all we do with all our tokens in this example we take only three tokens but suppose if there is a hundred there are hundred tokens this is going to be calculate with all hundred tokens over there after calculating the uh, dot product score over here like 7.96 8.32 we get the softmax score like this e raised to 7.96 divided by e raised to e raised to the sum of all three like 7.96 this so we get a relative score within each other each uh, each other tokens like three tokens so each token will take their part probability probability over there so all the sum of three comes as one so the concentration with the and the itself 0.3 the with quick is 0.5 the with brown is 0.1 sum comes as one yeah so here we can see we calculate the attention score with every other token now attention score finally the attention score gets created with the value so the already we have calculated this attention attention score uh, in percentage basis like 0.3 0.505.142 then value values are this we need we need to get the weighted sum for the so these are calculated for the only so the weighted sum for the is these number gets multiplied by v the v quick v brown we already see how do we calculate the value of the value of quick and value of brown by matrix multiplication and then with this weighted once we calculate this probability matter uh, probability number over here probability distribution then multiply it with values that we call as weighted sum finally after the calculation we get this so we get this the attention output of what the so this is the final outcome this is the final outcome of the after it gets impacting with all other input in our case the quick brown when the, the when all those input impact get impact over here then this new number gets formed what is so this is this is the modified final number and what is the previous number we see over there is this one two three and finalized number is 1.62 2.56 1 1.87 this is the example for the only in the similar manner we need to calculate for quick and brown as well so this covers our most important topic multi-head attention block so we get the uh, we give the input over here like this the quick brown and the new input new output after the processing from multi-head we get over here like this this is for the after all the calculation similarly we get the output for quick and brown so this block gets the input four dimensional vector and output four dimensional vector now it provides this output to the feed forward which we are going to see in our next video uh, and one more thing if you have any doubt related to this understanding comment me comment comment below i will i will give you the answer over there or create a video on to that confusion have a good day